life before St. Jude's. My cocaine use was really having a downhill effect on my life fast. Being Italian, uh, the two most important things in my life, my family and my job, were really affected by my abusing cocaine. I didn't care about anything like I used to anymore. I just, and that's not me. Abusing was really starting to make me become someone I never thought I would turn into. It was a bad time for me back then. I actually never had any treatment before St. Jude's. I felt really lucky that I never went. I knew some friends that went through the programs and the walls they had to break down after years of that stuff, so it seemed harder for them. I never had a bunch of powerlessness forced upon me, so it made it seem easier to move forward in the St. Jude's program. My experience at St. Jude's was amazing. I learned I didn't have an anchor on my neck like I used to, which made it seem like an endless battle. I didn't even think about the drugs when I was there. There was too much other stuff to learn and love, like softball every Thursday, camping, horseshoes, and other kind of relaxing things. But what I really loved the most was the class and the seminars. They taught me to be myself again. And while I'm still a hyper person, it's more balanced out. Life today is simpler, uh, much more enjoyable, mainly because I'm more responsible and I get that hard days aren't the end of the world. I hold my head up high and I'm more responsible and more mature and people can rely on me. One of the quotes that I love that I learned there was, you are what you think most about. And I carry that with me always. No matter where I am or what I'm doing, it makes me think and know that I can be whatever I want to be. And right now, I choose to be happy. I was nervous to go away to a program, but then I saw the website and immediately I was drawn right into it. They treat you with respect and dignity there and not as a broken person. St. Jude's is a place to get your mind right again. Where you leave as a different person not as an addict. You're in control.